Hi, today I'll show you how you can unload Opera browser. First of all, you have to get a downloader and there is a really high chance that you already have it on your device. If that's the case, then just skip to the next part of the video. But if you don't have the downloader yet, or you're not sure if it's properly set up, then watch this part of the video as well. We can get the downloader from the App Store, just go to search and start typing downloader here. As you can see, it already popped out here at the bottom for me. If it didn't in your case, then just type in the whole name of the app, which is once again the loader. Click on it. And here's the app which you need to install. But that's not it. We also have to set it up. To do so, we go to settings by clicking on that gear icon right here. Then we go to My Fire TV. Developer options. Make sure to enable ADB debugging. Then go to install unknown apps and turn this option on for the loader. But also there is a chance that you won't have the developer options visible by default, especially if you have a newer Fire Stick device. So if that's the case, firstly, to make developer options visible, we have to go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and click on the middle button on your remote for seven times. As you can see now at the bottom for me, it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. In your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if you just go back a bit, you will finally see the developer options. So once again, just turn this option on for the loader. And after that, we are ready to use the app. So open the loader. And here you'll see a search bar and we got to type a link here, which is going to be opera.com slash download. So that's the link. Make sure to type it in exactly as you see on the screen and then press and go. Then a website is going to open. You have to scroll down a bit. Press on that plus sign here. And then on the white don't have Google Play button. Click on it. And now the download of Opera browser is going to start. Then click on install in the right bottom corner. And after that, before actually clicking open, you have to click on done. And here we'll have an option to actually delete the installation file. And that's exactly what we're going to do because we don't need it anymore. We already installed the app and the installation files just take too much space in your device. So always click on delete and delete once again to free the space in your Fire TV Stick device. And then if you go to the list of your apps, you will finally see the Opera here, but there's actually one more step to use it. So what I really recommend doing is having a mouse dial device, which is going to allow you to use a mouse cursor, as you can see it on the screen here. So we enable the mouse dial app, and then we have to go to Opera. And here you'll notice that if you actually have a mouse toggle, it's going to be way easier for you to use a browser. So as you can see, I have an option to select the buttons and click on them. And without a mouse cursor, it really won't be possible. So if you want to know how to set up a mouse toggle app, I do have a tutorial for that and you'll see it on the screen. So click on the tutorial now. Good luck.